Hello. Um, so in this video, I want to show you how to apply fold over elastic to an areas like your bralette or your panties. So as you can see, there's this little line in the middle. That's where the folding would happen with the elastic. They've taken away some fibers in the middle to allow this kind of look. So it's a beautiful binding type thing for your um, bralette or panties or other things you might be working on. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to align the edge, the raw edge of the wrong side of my fabric, whether it's the panty or let's just say bralette, and I'm going to use my regular zigzag stitch. And I'm going to zigzag this on. And I'm just trying to align the this groove line here with the edge of my fabric and I have kind of a curve going on now so as you can see I'm trying to feed it into there to get it as close as possible. I think I'll just stop there. Okay, so I've got that. See how nice it stretches pretty well. Now I'm going to fold this over to cover my zigzag stitch and I'm going to switch my machine to the three step and I think I'm going to reduce the size a little as this is a tiny area and you need to be experimenting which is kind of what I'm doing right now to see how big so you're going to fold that edge right over where it's already indented Now this, imagine, would be with your matching thread, unless contrast was your choice for design. Now the, this is uh, two layers of elastic, basically, you're sewing over with the zigzag and a fabric. So I'm, I'm not stretching, but I am helping. Like, I'm, I'm helping it not get stuck in the machine. You know, it's, this is a home machine. It won't, won't feed it quite as well, probably, as the industrial. And there you go. See how beautiful that is? And secure, right? So this is my right side of my garment. And imagine that with like the matching thread would be really beautiful. Although this looks pretty too. 